Hi everyone. Today we will learn order set delineation. We will be using multiple tools to create an order set. So first we will use the Google Earth web to create a water set and then we will use the digital elevation model or DEM data. We will download the, the DEM data from the Google Earth engine. Then we will reproject this DEM. We will create a hillside map and we will try create a 2D and 3D map using ArcGIS and ArcSyn. Using this DEM data we will also delineate the water set using Arc tool and Arc SWOT and we will also create a stream order map using the Arc toolbox. So let us begin with uh, water set delineation using Google Earth Wave. So first go to Google and just search Google Earth. So this first search you can open. This is the online version of Google Earth. Here uh, we can see the Google Earth and also we will be able to create uh, the water set. And uh, here we can, uh, can get both the land surface feature and the topographic elevation. So basically in hilly terrain it is much easier to delineate water set or micro water set basically uh, as the topographic uh, elevation change is very rapid but it is slightly uh, difficult in topographically flat terrain because the elevation difference uh, or elevation change is not that uh, steep. So we have taken one sample region this is north of West Bengal state near to the Sikkim. So one can easily identify the elevation changes in this region. So that's why we have taken this particular area. One can take uh, nearby other regions also or any other study area. So here uh, we will use this particular area for our water set delineation and uh, the ridges are easily, identify easily identifiable. We will be using this draw line tool here and create a polygon. So we can start from this point and uh, use the mouse click to create the boundary of our catchment. You have to just uh, connect the ridges. it is asking to close the shape. Now we can add a project title. We can add a title to this polygon. Water set. We can add pictures also. To save just click on go back it is now saved and uh, we'll download this kml file to do that click on more action click on export as kml mm, let us create a folder so this is an empty folder micro water set delineation this folder is empty we can use this folder i will just keep my kml file here now i'll be using online KML to save file converter any of any one of this uh, website can be used I'll be using the second one 
HTML to uh, save file online converter here. Just drag and drop my KML file. I'll save this as save file. There are multiple options available, but I'll be using output as save file. Click on no convert. Download option is available here. Click on download. Once it is downloaded, this is available in zip file. So let's just unzip. Yeah, the zip file is available here. Now we'll open this zip file using ArcGIS. So let's just open ArcGIS. It's not the right STM. So this is our micro water set created using the Google Earth. And if you want to check this properly, you can overlap uh, this layer on the Google Earth base map. It is all also available in ArcGIS. So we just show it again. This is the add button data. Just uh, click on this round drop arrow add base map and this is the one imagery you have to wait for couple of minutes depending on the speed of your internet You can see this is perfectly overlaid. Yeah. Now I'll stop here, and in the next video, we'll see how to download an SRTM DM using Google Earth Engine, and we'll reproject that. We'll create a hillside map, and we'll create 2D and 3D map using ArcGIS.